welcome to Skywagon's University. So we did a video on this a month or so ago, and it's on the channel, but it was just static, talking about bird dogs, L19s, a little bit of history about them. Since then, um, we've, I've asked the owner, who very kindly has said we can fly it. So Diana, Diana Stanger is the owner of this plane, a very prominent pilot and jet pilot, and she races at Reno and things. This is her like weekend toy kind of plane. And she said that I can fly it. So we're going to fly it today, and we're going to show you... Uh, what it can do. So Diana, thanks very much for that, and we hope you enjoy it. Okay, ready? ready. Okay, to start it, I've already got the battery on because I wanted the microphone to be live. So here are the magnetos. So I'm gonna turn on both mags. Mixture, output to rich with a little lock. Crack the throttle. Start a button here, clear. Give it a little bit of fuel pressure. Clear. And then immediately check. Oh. Possible traffic, Bird Dog 38032 is going to be departing runway 5, a right turnout, Placerville, local flight. Full power. Stick forward, nose down, and she's flying. And she's flying at 40. Here by Romeo, leaving the pattern elevator. Now, uh, I'm pulling back on the throttle a little bit, putting up flaps. Comes down here on the left. This thing's nice. Now pulling back the RPM. Pull it back to 20. Well, the, the top of the green's 23. I'll put it at 22.5. Oh, yeah. So this plane belongs to a lady at Placerville Airport called Diana Stanger. And uh, she very kindly let me video it the first time, but it was having its fuel pump replaced, so I couldn't fly it. That's on this other video we have. But today, there's a fuel pump, and Diana, again, has let me fly it. Very generous of her. And thank you very much for that. The other one we had was, was a constant speed, so I had manifold pressure and RPM. This one is kick pitch, so I'm just kind of looking for things to do. But Placerville, uh, Bird Dog 38032 is on the right downwind, runway 5. It'll be a uh, low and slow overflight of the airport photographic mission. And the RPM is up again. She's keen to rev, I tell you. May 3. Remember from my pilot training, pilot attitude, uh, power attitude trim, so you're always adjusting the power on a fixed pitch. Strange not to have the mic button on top of the stick, but we'll get used to it. Placerville, Bird Dog 032, right base 5, Placerville.
Very different to a 180, it's got a kind of very military feel to it, kind of a little bit. Sort of, uh, just not rough around the edges, but more utilitarian. With a cup feel, because of the stick and the side throttle. Placerville, 032, final for 5, and I will not be landing. That's a good view of the airport, so he's on a hill, there's a flat top hill. Fly all the way down the runway just for the scenery. This thing has got incredible visibility, I mean in every direction. Step straight down, but what a fantastic plane! Add some power, climb out into the pattern again. Placerville 032 is on a right crosswind for five at Placerville. Placerville, 032, right down here for 5, Placerville, full stop. Settle up. Willow traffic, light Fort Low Wing at 2 miles to the west. Line Look at that. 2,500, departing to the Dean, you restored this thing. Look how nicely rigged it is. It's fantastic. Apart from being shot at, this would be a fantastic plane to have flown at work. Traffic 032, right base, full stop, 5, class of it. So we're very much in the flap arc. Right, put it down a little bit. Rich in the mixture a tiny bit. Find the runway. You can see the runway out of the skylight it's on a 45 degree bank onto final. Placerville 032 is on final for five, full stop Placerville. Build the full flaps. Here's the buffet on the elevator. Doing 60. Let's see if I can get away with another one. The main thing on any tail dragger is keep it straight. Get away with murder if you keep it straight. So we're doing 60. A little bit more. Now she's down, power gently back, keep it straight. On the ground, you have back throttle off. That was much better. Flaps up. So we got away with that. <laughs> Thank you again, Diana. Um, this is Mark at Skywagon University. Doing a quick little uh, run around the pattern a few times in an L19 bird dog. So subscribe on the link below, click on the bell for notifications, and um, thanks for watching.